Kumbaya, my lord. Hi guys, and welcome back to another video. In today's video, we are going to be doing the whole like, um, answering people's assumptions about me or whatever it's called. It's going around on YouTube and I really wanted to film one because I really wanted to know what people were going to say. And I actually got like a lot more than I thought. I thought like two people were going to say something. And so I'm just going to go through them and I guess we can learn more about myself or maybe my self-esteem will lower. I don't know. We'll figure it out. You like Elon Musk. If you don't, I don't know what to say, Christona. I like Elon Musk, I guess. You're so weird, Grace. You're so weird. You have a perfect life, amazing friends, family, support system. I wish, dude. Um, I don't think anyone has a perfect life, so. No. You're friends with everyone. I wish, dude. I so wish. I wish I could be friends with everyone, but I feel like people don't want to be my friend, but like I also understand, so. Don't know. You love to travel. Oh my gosh, I love to travel so much. Like if I could travel like the rest of okay if anyone could travel the rest of life they would want to but like I'm not really like a I don't feel like I'm like a homesick type of person I'm not like a I don't really want to go on that trip like I would literally travel anywhere I want to go so many places so yes definitely want to do that I met you I thought you'd be rude but once I met you you're super sweet okay I feel like I haven't looked through all of these but I feel like I got this one a lot because I just get this one a lot like in my life people are like oh before I like talk to you I thought you were gonna be like really rude and I think it's well I hope it's just because at school I feel like I have a like a RBF face or whatever and I don't like mean to I just like do or people just like assume things about you assumptions so yes that's nice though I love you girl assumption but you're super sweet I'm illiterate I'm literally illiterate not an assumption, but you are super sweet and kind. Keep doing this. I love your vids. Okay, you're adorable. That's not an assumption. You're you're right, but love that. Love you. Um, that you would be unapproachable, but you're not. That's like another one of them. I feel like I'm kind of weird, honestly. I think sometimes, okay, sometimes when I'm like sitting in class with people who are like, not like normal, but like, I'm like odd. Like I feel like I make them uncomfortable, which is such a good trait to have. So that's awesome. Um, you can't do a cartwheel, ha. Huh? Yes, I can. Excuse me. Um, you're wrong about that one. You are <laughs> you are a smart person and are studying econ or finance like me. Um, I don't really know if econ's my thing anymore. That you're really good at school. No. <laughs> like the person that like gets stressed way too much. But this year is a lot better. I don't really care this year. Senioritis, it's like a real thing. But it's also just because my classes are like easier this year. And I just like maximize my time in class. Holy crap. Kind of cocky. Um, I hope not. Uh, I always say I think I suck at everything. So I don't... I hope not. Sorry. You're a great editor for YouTube. That's sweet. Thank you. Um... I feel like I don't really know how to do anything. I just know how to do what I know how to do. That made literally no sense. Next one. You're absolutely gorgeous and seem so sweet, but you don't even know I exist. Haha. -ha. Um, hello. I do know you exist now, and that's really sweet. That's not an assumption. Or maybe it is. I don't know. But thank you. That's sweet. <laughs> you look like a falcon. <laughs> well, you're not wrong. A lot of people actually do assume that about me, so it doesn't make me sad, but crap so when I first met you I thought you were an, an oh my god I'm literally illiterate when I first met you I thought you were an annoying rich girl but then the person it's okay because then she says but you're not so I love you love you too um and yo no I'm not I'm not rich I might be annoying but I'm definitely not rich you are a size eight in shoes I Wish I did. I'm literally Bigfoot. My shoes are so big. I wear like a size 10. Ew, that's like ugly. Why am I showing you that? The shoes are cute, but not the size. Okay, next one. Basketball season is your favorite time of year during high school. So true. I feel like I've said that in a vlog. Literally love basketball season so much. It's fun. I think I like it just because I don't like love football. Or no, football's fine. I just don't really know what's going on, which is so stereotypical of like a girl, but like I don't. And also, it's outside and it's cold and they're long. But basketball season is really fun. You eat poop. 
no, no. Someone started that rumor and it don't mean to call anyone out, but like someone, Rachel Erb or something, started that rumor and that was rude, so. Hella sassy, but I love it for you. Super jealous of your fashion. Thank you, that's really nice. And um, I feel like I am sassy. Or like I'm, yeah, yeah, I would say I'm probably sassy, like s savage at times, but I don't know, I don't wanna like, don't wanna be too cocky here, you know what I mean, so. You have everything figured out, like in life. Literally, no. Uh, not at all, I feel like. I feel like, okay, actually no. Like one week, I have like everything figured out. Like my planner's all cute. But then the next week, I'm like literally a mess. Like a complete mess. Hee <laughs> hee, I know you, but you are, you are the sweetest and most outgoing person ever. I love you. I love you too. And I feel like I am pretty outgoing. Sometimes I can be like, oddly shy no i'm outgoing i don't know i feel like i make people uncomfortable with how like you know what i mean i don't know if you do whatever that i annoy you sometimes no you don't don't say that you bite your nails because i don't see them i don't bite my nails but the acrylics i had on a while ago did destroy them so but will i get the acrylics again probably will they destroy my nails again probably so that's good you're insecure you're not wrong. Jared is better than you in biotech. That is 1000% for sure. Um, I take this class called biotech and like, it's like a, okay, it's not an easy class. It's not like an AP, it's just like a normal class. And I literally feel so stupid in that class. Like we're talking about like this lab and like the write up and I literally like have no idea what she's saying. But it's a fun class. But Jared, yeah, you're, or sorry, it needs to be anonymous. Jared's definitely better than me in biotech. Love this one. Love this one. You are probably freaking hilarious. Okay, first off, love you. Um, second, definitely not. If anyone's laughing like at me, it's because my joke was so bad. Like, I'm not even exaggerating. My joke was so bad that they're laughing at how bad it was. Like, you can ask my friends. It gets really bad sometimes, but then also, sometimes I can be funny. My friends don't admit it, but I know that they think I'm funny, so. Never really talked to you, but I assume you are a nice, popular person would be nice to talk to you. Um, I feel like I know who you are. I know who you are. You're hilarious. And um, thank you. That's actually really sweet. No one was really that mean. I was like pleasantly surprised, but I was like, be honest, please. So yeah, that is all the ones I'm going to do today. I have no idea how long this was. Oh my gosh, it was 17 minutes. Jesus Christ. Okay, well. If you guys want to follow me on Instagram, then you guys totally should. I, it's like weird to me because I literally have so many subscribers like so fast. I'm like confused where you guys all came from, but like welcome. Because I feel like I want to do like a Q&A, even though there's like boring and like not fun sometimes. I feel like I never ever did like an intro or like anything to my channel. I just like bought my camera and then vlogged when my friends and I went to Palm Springs. And so... Like, I feel like some people don't even, like, know anything about me. This is, like, the first video I've ever done where I've just, like, sat down. Oh, my God. My neighbors are looking at me again. Again. This is, like, literally the first video I've ever filmed, I think. Well, that, that I'm uploading. Don't worry. I filmed a lot. But then I'm, like, oh, my God. I'm so awkward. Uh, this is the first video I've ever filmed, like, sitting down, like, and talking to the camera. Ew. That sounds weird. Um, But... Yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed. Sorry if I looked at the viewfinder so much. I genuinely never remember to look in the camera, so I'm sure that pisses someone off. But anyways, that is all I have for you guys today. Make sure you guys subscribe and follow me on Instagram if you want to be like in the next Q&A or something. Not the next one, because I've never done one. Um, okay, well, yeah, I need to end this video. I hope you guys enjoy it and make sure you guys subscribe. And all you guys were actually, don't look at me. Please don't look at me. Neighbor, just keep... Thank God.